Good morning, everyone. Today uh, is going to be a very short video. It's more of an announcement than anything else. And I just recently published it on my website, so you can go there and see it. But we have a bit of good news. As of last night, MVPs were informed that the uh, new modern web browser control, so the one that should be using uh, the Chromium uh, and should no longer pose any problems for using any of the modern web browser, HTML, CSS, all of that stuff should render properly and give us the ability now to do even more with the web browser. Well, the Access Dev team has released it uh, to beta in insider users only. So it hasn't hit mainstream. It's not um, available to the general public yet. But to anyone that's in the beta or insiders channel, uh, you can update, and the build number is given right here. If you update to this build number or a greater build number, uh, you will now have access to that new control. And as you can see in the image here, this is what you're looking for to insert it. What you need to know? Well, you need to know that, number one, you have to be... Uh, beta or insiders using Microsoft Office 365. Um, you also have to be aware that currently there is very little to no documentation, although I do believe from what we were led to believe that it will be coming very shortly. So hopefully we'll get some good information there to help us utilize this new control. But this truly is uh, nice. This is something that was originally promised for 2021. So we're at least two years behind um, and they're wanting feedback. So any of you that are on these channels that decide to take it for a test drive, uh, please give feedback, both positive and negative. They like to hear positive things too. And if you are giving any negative feedback, you encounter problems, be sure to give them a means to contact you back. So include your email address. And if you're able to give reproductive steps, what did you do exactly to hit the problem? Uh, that helps them greatly. Screenshots, anything like that, that can help them isolate the issue and remedy it. Um, and as always, I'm assuming they're doing this because they're hoping to iron out all these issues before it gets released officially on the uh, main production uh, update channels. Um, official announcements, there are none. Uh, nothing's been posted on the official access blog. There's nothing about this being an insider beta testing right now on the roadmap. So we don't have any other th information to give you besides a very limited amount of information that was provided to MVPs yesterday. And that's why I posted it on my website. That's why I'm doing this video is let's try to get the information out there that there is a new feature um, that you know was promised to us while they're finally delivering on it. So let's get it out there. Uh, access is still alive. Um, and that's going to be it for today, guys. Hope you all have a great day. Like, subscribe, share, and we'll see you in the next video.